A brief hands-on look at iOS 12 Beta 4 changes and features. In the previous beta, when you perform a search in the App Store app, you'll see results that look like this. Pretty much what you would expect, but in iOS 12 Beta 4, your results will look like this. So now you get results that include developers and stories. The info button that appears in the bottom right hand corner of wallet app items has been changed in iOS 12 beta 4. Here it is on beta 3, just your normal info button, right? But if we switch over to beta 4, you'll notice that the info button is now an ellipsis button. Obviously a very subtle change there. In the previous data, your mobile data usage under the cellular panel in the settings app was sorted in alphabetical order. But in iOS 12 beta 4, it's now sorted by usage, which makes a lot more sense when you think about it. So now your most used app from a cellular data perspective is going to be at the top. You can see mine is, of course, Safari right there. Those of you who enjoy customizing your Memoji characters in iOS 12 will be happy to know that there are now additional lip styles in beta 4. So you saw you had six lip styles to choose from in the previous beta, but now if I scroll up here, you're going to see nine lip styles. And more Memoji goodness, in the previous beta, your earring colors were just flat colors. So you could choose from any of these colors, but they were just flat, right? But earrings are usually like blingy or metallic, right? So in iOS 12 beta 4, Apple considered that. So you can see that the earring colors now have metallic properties, or at least sort of a gradient property, making the earrings stand out. The share icons in the Photos app share sheet have changed up a little bit in beta 4. So here's beta 3, you can see AirPlay, High, Duplicate, etc. But in beta 4, they have changed and what stands out the most is the AirPlay icon. The others have changed as well, but they're just more subtle. The now playing music info, which includes song, title, artist, and album have been pushed up in beta 4. Yep, in beta 4 indeed, you can see that the music info is closer to the timeline. The Voice Memos app has its settings slightly altered in beta 4. So here's beta 3, you can see default name. You can choose between current location and recording number, but in beta 4, it's been simplified with a location-based naming toggle. Now here's beta 3's battery settings panel in the settings app. You can see at the bottom, there is no explainer, but if we switch over to beta 4, you can see the explainer text at the very bottom of the battery settings. And for this last one, I don't have a comparison with beta three, but here you can see new activity stickers in the messages app. So you get additional stickers in iOS 12 beta four. So ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this has been Jeff Benjamin with a look at what's new in iOS 12 beta four. Let me know what you think in the comments. This is Jeff with nine to five Mac.